Good afternoon and happy Friday. Welcome to Feel Good Fridays with Pastor Kristen um, on this Memorial Day weekend. Um, who would have ever guessed when we decided to move to online worship in the middle of March that we still would be um, sheltering at home at the end of May. Um, I don't think any of us thought that that is how this would go, but here we are. And uh, I hope that things are going well for you and that you are finding ways um, to be filled with joy and to experience God in the midst of these days. For me, this was a week when I realized that my cup was getting pretty empty. Um, I was... I had the chance to, over the past couple of weeks, to connect with some friends that I don't see very often, and it was so great to see them and spend some time talking with them, but I think it also made me realize just how much I miss them um, and miss being with people in general. Uh, and so I was really feeling, um, really feeling pretty empty yesterday. And so I took some time to sit down with my ukulele and play through some songs. And as I was playing, um, I am the first to admit that I am no musician. Um, and as I was playing, I was really struggling with matching my voice to the chords that I was playing until I got to one song in particular. And I think it's because this is the song that I needed to hear um, and needed to share this week. This song is uh, a favorite of mine from Camp Days, uh, but is also extra special because it became uh, a name for a group of friends and I, as we gathered at a retreat, we were to name our table group and we named ourselves the Overflowing Cups um, and made our little cups like this so that when you're singing the song, you can have your little cup that you're taking a drink out of. Um, and so a little extra shout out to my friend Diane. Um, for whom we both had worked at camp together and had done this song and had the cups. And when we named our group the Overflowing Cups, we decided we also had a handshake and both of us immediately made this um, with our hands and then like did a handshake like that. And it was, it's a little bit, um, one of those moments where you do something like that when you're not planning to, that is almost a little bit scary because it was, um, not intended, but hysterically funny. So, um, the song for today is called Fill My Cup. And so I hope in these days that you are finding ways to fill your cups, to allow God to fill your cups uh, to overflowing. So we're going to go a little bit different order than normal today. I'm going to sing and then I'm going to share some scripture with you. So, Fill My Cup. If you know it, sing along. Fill my cup and let it overflow. Fill my cup and let it overflow. Yeah. Fill my cup and let it overflow. Let it overflow with love. Jesus loves me, this I know. For the Bible tells me so. Yeah. Little ones to him belong. They are weak, but he is strong. Fill my cup and let it overflow. Fill my cup and let it overflow. Oh, yeah. Fill my cup and let it overflow. Let it overflow with love. So, um, I do hope that your cups are being filled. Um, we know that we can't share from those cups unless we fill them up ourselves first. And so I hope that you are finding ways uh, for your cups to be filled. And uh, as a way to do that, I share with you Psalm 16 from the New Revised Standard Version of Scripture. 
Protect me, O God, for in you I take refuge. I say to the Lord, you are my Lord. I have no good apart from you. As for the holy ones in the land, they are the noble, in whom is all my delight. Those who choose another God multiply their sorrows. Their drink offerings of blood I will not pour out or take their names upon my lips. The Lord is my chosen portion and my cup. You hold my lot. The boundary lines have fallen for me in pleasant places. I have a goodly heritage. I bless the Lord who gives me counsel. In the night also, my heart instructs me. I keep the Lord always before me. Because he is at my right hand, I shall not be moved. Therefore, my heart is glad and my soul rejoices. My body also rests secure. For you do not give me up to Sheol or let your faithful one see the pit. You show me the path of life. In your presence, there is fullness of joy. In your right hand are pleasures forevermore. I hope that in these days you are finding the fullness of joy that comes from God. Have a great day, everybody.